new in the night team tonight. An alleged dog attack in a Deerfield Park in Smithfield has a couple turning to the public for help. They and their dog are left with severe bite marks and bruises. And now they're hoping that any witness with video will come forward to clear up exactly what happened. The night team's Molly Levine joins us live in Smithfield with the story. Molly. Yeah, Dan and Patrice, the couple says it happened right here in broad daylight at Deerfield Park, and they're asking anyone who may have witnessed it to come forward. Walking um, outside of the playground on the cement area. A normal weekend walk. There was a pit bull that was leashed um, on the fence. Until it wasn't. The pit bull lunged again at Nala, and this time broke its collar and, or leash. Um, and charged right after her. Selena Mello and her boyfriend John Mitchell were walking their dog Nala Saturday afternoon around 3 p.m. when they say they were charged at by a pit bull. John actually picked Nala up um, in an attempt to get the other dog off from her, but the pit bull was still latched on to her face. That's when Selena stepped in, also attempting to get the dog off of Nala. I have puncture wounds to my wrist, uh, my outer arm, and my thigh going into immediate shock and protective mode did the owner say anything you know after this all happened help you guys at all no they actually tried to take off while they didn't get the chance to speak with the dog's owner before rushing Nala to the emergency vet, Selena and John filed a police report, but claim there are inconsistencies in it, including that their dog initiated the contact and also bit Selena. But they say that's untrue. So now they're looking for witnesses to come forward with cell phone video so they can get the story straight. Um, we're very thankful for the bystanders who did help us, who called EMS, who called police, who called animal control. So they can make sure this doesn't happen to any other dogs or people. So they were right up against the playground. Um, just terrifying to think that that could happen to a small child. And do right by the pup she adopted from the Potter League eight years ago. To try to spread awareness and um, get some justice for Nala. And you. And we did reach out to police for comment in the police report, but didn't hear back tonight. Anyone who may have witnessed this incident should reach out to John or Selena on Facebook. I'm live from Smithfield, Molly Levine, NBC 10 News Night Team. Team